Good afternoon. I'm Father Joe from our house in El Salvador. Today I am in one of the chapels in my monastery in Pennsylvania. The, the church, the basilica, is being decorated and they're, they're working over there. So one of our chapels, one of our many chapels. Today is a strange day. Lent has passed but we haven't started the masses yet. We haven't started the celebrations yet. So we're kind of in limbo here. Tonight, we're going to celebrate the mass which celebrates the mass. It's a mass in which we honor, which we, we celebrate that Jesus Christ gave us the Eucharist. So it's a mass of the mass. A mass of the Eucharist of the Eucharist. Tomorrow, we're going to celebrate the passion and death of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And in Sunday, we'll celebrate the resurrection. Tomorrow is something that we understand well. We all understand suffering. We all understand death. In many ways, it's, we're comfortable with it because it's something, something we know, something we're familiar with. Eucharist. Sacraments, mysteries, resurrection, these things we don't know. We can't, we can't comprehend the, the things that the Lord has for us. But suffering and death, that's ours. So this suffering and death is a clear invitation for us to enter in with Jesus Christ. To pass through our sufferings, to pass through our death. Strengthened by the Eucharist so that we can enter into the resurrection, a resurrection of Jesus Christ, a resurrection in Jesus Christ. So Jesus Christ invites every one of you, every one of us, to enter into our passion, to enter into our own deaths, and in that, to meet Jesus Christ. And in that, to enter into our resurrection with our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I wish you all a very joyful Easter, even though we need to celebrate it without any masses. But nonetheless, we celebrate it. And please know that during these holy days, you will be in my prayer.